<laughs> so Jason, you're basically showing me footage of the same video that you post to Facebook. No, no, this is a times. new one. Who, when this was this one made? Me. This is yesterday. So are you now going to post this one ten times a day on Facebook? It's is this going to be the new one that you terrorize everyone with? <laughs> yes. <laughs> For every time you make a new fan or add a new friend on Facebook, 20 people hide you from their timelines because of your overposting of videos. Tribute videos. Tribute videos, yes. And you wanted me to make you one too. But there are already like a hundred new tribute videos of you. <laughs> anyway, good morning, brother. What's up? You look a little sleepy. You look a little tired. What are you training today? <laughs> Chest and biceps. Looks like Chuck's deadlifting. You deadlift. Reverse curling, buddy. You're doing forearm curls here? Reverse curls. Even harder. Reverse curls. <laughs> nice. I'll, I'll work in with you. No problem. No, wait, 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 wait. Skull crushers. <laughs> the chart is ready to go, as we see. Yeah, I'm doing like 15 minute rest between sets, dude. I'm, I'm just slacking, man. That's all right. Yeah, it worked like 9 o'clock last night, man. What time? Nice, Mike. <laughs> you release that power. That was a You gotta love it. Uh, all right, well, ain't nothing, ain't nothing but a peanut. Shit. You know, Jason, I know you joke around a lot. Well, maybe you're not saying that you're a T101 cyborg. But you know what? I've kind of been thinking about it. I think you really might actually be a Terminator that was sent back through time. Think about it. What is it, what is it Reese says in a Terminator? You can't bargain with it. You can't reason with it. You can't negotiate with it. It's a killing machine. It's a killing machine. They're very hard to spot because they have bad breath. They smell, they bleed, they sweat. So, I think you were like sent back through time to terminate coaches and trainers. First you started with Skip LaCour, terminated, right? <laughs> then you moved, you came back through time with a list of coaches to terminate. <laughs> then came PJ Braun. I'm sure there were a couple of others along the way. I'm just thinking of the prominent ones. Sickening odor. It's up there today. I wasn't going to say anything, but since you want to mention it, I will concur. Jason smells like a prison yard this morning. Well, Waiting for some of the other misfits to arrive this morning. Everybody, please be a little patient. We will have a full house in here before you know it. In the meantime, it's all about the cyborg. Jason, how many tribute videos would satisfy you? Give me a number, like 10 new tribute videos a week, <laughs> yeah. 15, 20. What number would satisfy your craving for tribute videos? Because he's been asking me to make a new tribute video and I don't have the skills that some of these other characters do to make one of these videos. Yet every time I wake up, I see like a new tribute video posted Just shoot the raw footage on his Facebook. Else. There is so much raw footage of Jason already floating around on YouTube. You can make like a 25 hour long documentary. Yet he still insists on more footage, more tribute videos. A Terminator one, a Star Wars one, a, a, a Godzilla one, a, ba a Bambi one. <laughs> like, when's it going to be enough? And I thought people, only people who are dead get tribute videos. Either dead or retired. Not when you're a living legend. I guess not. <laughs> so you want more tribute videos? Yeah. <laughs> Someone needs to make a Godzilla, a, a Jason versus Bambi. A Terminator. Yeah. Do you remember, what, what did you ask me to do this weekend? 
make you a Terminator tribute video, right? You yeah, remember that? Yeah. Okay, but there's already one on here. <laughs> so, so you want another one? Another one. <laughs> it's sick. You are greedy, man. <laughs> See, that's why I say Jason really is a cyborg. Yeah. You can't bargain with him or reason with him or negotiate with him. It is just pissing. What are we doing here? Chuck? Well, the setting can be pretty, but I'm trying. Chuck, I have been filming unpretty stuff in this gym now for years, so. Yeah, but if I get stuck, it'll be even better. Well, if you get stuck, like, are you shit out of luck or are you gonna be okay? I'll be all right. I'll stay here. Gotta go heavy sometimes. Did you? Yeah, no. 95 pound numbers. We're filming a video on Jason's camera right now while I'm filming, and I just had to instruct Jason. That's lightweight, baby. Jason, Jason has not been clearing out the memory card on this camera, so we're in the middle of filming a video on his camera, and it just stopped filming. And Jason actually figured out the problem. The memory card is full. Here's what I do with my camera, Jason. Here's a little tutorial. Always clear out your memory card after you upload the videos to YouTube to prevent that from happening. Yeah. All right? Yeah, all right. Oh, Can you dig it? I dig it. All right, back to your... If you thought you'd get, you'd get down to 10%, we calculated about 186. That's wrong. Let's see, lose six from 16 to 10 percent at 200 pounds, lose six percent, that's 12 pounds, that's 188. Yeah, but then you gotta remember losing water weight on top of it. The well, water weight's not fat. Yeah, but it's still gonna, you're still gonna drench it off. Bench it off? Did he say bench it off? Drench it off. <laughs> I thought he said bench it off. It's filming my camera. Jason? Holy shit. I'm gonna sickening two and a half pound plate. Uh-oh, I almost just knocked it off. Jason, what you, look around this whole gym. What, what goes around the perimeter of the whole gym? What are those? Those glass things on the wall? No. What are they? I don't know. What do you look in and flex every 10 seconds? The mirror. The mirror. The mirror's your friend, right? Yeah. You need to go by what you see in the mirror the scale and numbers and body fat percentages going up and down and up and down, that shit will drive you crazy. And now you're like borderline obsessed with numbers as it is already. The last thing you need is to keep obsessing over numbers, percentages, weight. Look in the mirror, see how you look. Your arms are looking the best I've ever seen. Your stomach still needs work, but it is slowly improving. Go by what you see in the mirror. Those are your words. The mirror's your friend, right? The mirror's your friend. Okay, good. Say it again. The mirror's your friend. Say it one more time. The mirror's your friend. What is not your friend? Yeah, but the you scale. Like shit, the mirror's not your friend. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. Then the mirror's your enemy. <laughs> but the scale and the body fat percentage thing could be your enemy just as much if you're doing it 10 times a day and it's constantly fluctuating and driving me. Yes, okay, Jason, here, I'll film you. I'll shut up now. Ready? <laughs> Jason, have you ever taken any kind of boxing class or boxing lessons? No. Ready? I thought for sure you'd say, you'd say he was a pro, pro boxer. No, I'm saying, Jason, how about on Monday, come here a second? Are you off on Mondays? I don't know if I stay. All right. Because if you want to start, we can start training with JT on Monday mornings, doing a little boxing on the old basketball court. Be good. I'd be willing to do it. Yeah. Actually, that would probably be great for your rear delts and your traps. Good. That's why boxers always... too. And good for your abs good and your core. Be good for mine too. I'd do it. JT just offered. Good. All right, let's do it. <laughs> he doesn't even care. I need I'm an app 30 at like noon today. Huh. All right, Jason, I'm ready. When you're doing this too. Your head was redder when you were doing benches yesterday. Was it? <laughs> do you see Batman? You should have got me the other day. He's Batman. We were spotting him. <laughs> Batman, yeah. Oh, Chuck was spotting you benching? Well, I almost broke my back. How the hell did you do that? I think you were smart. Oh, when you were declining? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not a big C going. You know? One. That's because I don't know how to lift. Two. Yeah, you're pretty strong for someone who doesn't know how to lift. Oh. 
Jason, I'll be there in a second. Six. Seven. Whoa. Sickening. Well, okay, what's your self-critique as you watch yourself? 12%. You say you're about 12%? Yeah. Close. Definitely close. That's the best one. I'm not 14, I was 13.5 on the test. Wrong. Wait, no, in that last video you did with Adam? What, no, you know, no, 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 I'm not. came up around there. Wait, I'm not going there again. It came up around there. Because I don't want to get into a disagreement with Jason over his body fat. It's not worth it. Greg, that little what do you think his body fat is currently today? Stop, you know what, I'm not leaving. What's the matter? Why you, now you're leaving right when I get here. Sure. Jason, you can't, die. Brad just got here. What did, <laughs> whoa, Boy, Jason, come on, man. Birthday. What'd you do? Wait a minute, let me guess. You watched a Star Wars marathon and jerked yourself dry. Yeah. Is that, yeah, that's what you did. I, I fucking knew. How's, how's your CrossFit training? You know, I hear that's, that shit is for middle-aged women and faggots. And you don't look like a middle-aged woman. What do you think? That's what I hear. I think he's too busy watching himself hey, does, pose. Does, so. your guy, does your guy Jay Cutler do CrossFit? He does a little bit. Does I'm he little, really? I'm, yeah, he does. The bodybuilders do that shit now? A little bit. Just a little bit. Not too much. You look better though. Where's your buddy at? He's not here yet. Where are you going? I'll be back. Damn. I hate to say it, but it's like almost worse than a girl with his body fat percentage. Well, this is the point I was making to him on camera and off camera. He needs to stop obsessing over numbers and body fat percentages. It's just and that tool's so it's not worth it. He looks. Well, get a real reading, man. Check yourself every month. Spend the money. Check yourself every month with a real reading. Oh, here he comes. He's coming back. Come on back. I want to break your balls some more. <laughs> hey, Brad. Someone on YouTube wants me to ask you where you get your ink done. The guy's website is acidbaby.com. Just like it sounds? Yes. Yeah, acid. Acidbaby.com. Right, right. He's got his number in there and everything, so. Good He's stuff. in Fort Lauderdale. Oh, there you have it. Right, if only that thing weighed 100 pounds, you'd have fucking huge arms. All right, let's weigh myself. You just weighed yourself no, four times. No, not weigh myself. I made a mistake. Let's take a picture. I made a mistake. <laughs> How do you mistake weighing yourself with taking I'm a picture? I'm half asleep. <laughs> yeah, what's the matter with you today? You're not even sweating. He looks better though, actually. Oh, absolutely. This is the best his arms have ever looked. Mm. I keep telling him that. You went from pasty, pudgy, and furry to now you're just a little furry. <laughs> What's going on with your neck, dude? Burn. Do you have that shit that Michael Jackson had, that vitiligo? No, it's a burn. I've had it for years. I've had it since childhood. Yeah, he's had that. Since I don't know if you knew this. Did you know that that lightsaber lights up? Does it really? Yeah, I didn't even know that. I read it. Someone posted it on the forum. Does it? Supposedly it does. Yeah. We verified. There's a switch on the bottom that you have to. You have to put batteries in there. You think that? That kids' room in the back go in there. It's pitch black in there. You would think that one of us would have figured out that it probably lights up, but. Yeah. What are you doing today? Carrying your phone around? I'm ready. I want to. Jason take my just picture. wants me to take pictures of him because there aren't enough of him already on Hold Facebook. On. No, Instagram. It's my Instagram. Oh, Instagram. I'm sorry. sorry All right, Jason. I will take as many pictures as you want. Oh, boy. I'm just showing you. Wait, whoa, whoa, out. whoa. Jason, what What are you talking about here? All right, from the back, when he was posing, I can't really tell, but it's what front delt was like really huge, but then from the back, it looked like it was like lack back here. You got permission to take your shirt off again? This is an illusion. You need to get a tan. What's an illusion? You look better. He's saying it's an illusion. What I'm trying to point out is Hayden. What are you saying? That he has his rear delts are under From the, the back, when he was posing straight out, it looked like the back center was just lack of development and the front was just... He's a little cranky. Like this was just way shot. huge. Of course, maybe mine was too. Brad, like, he was in a good mood till you got here. I'm blaming you. Actually, he was in a good mood until I called, asked Brad how much his body fat was to Jason. He is just... 
Done a complete 180 since Brad arrived. <laughs> What's your name, man, again? Jim. Jim? Yeah. Andrew, that's right. I always yeah. see you and we always talk. Yeah. And yeah. It's amazing how constructive you're yeah. Jim Jim is one of the snowbirds that we like. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Brad. <laughs> Appreciate it. Jim manages to lurk in the back of the video. It's the background sometimes. And... Uh, I try not to, Andrew. No, I don't mind. It's just funny because people are like, who's that tall guy with the long hair? And I'm like, oh my God. we have some really observant viewers out there because they don't yeah, miss a thing. What's in the background. Yeah. <laughs> I thought I was the only one that. No. First thing I look at. No. He's in the bathroom right now, like, loading up two uh, Tech 9s. He's going to come, come mow us down. <laughs> Uh, he can take it. Uh, whatever. What are you going to do? He's very sensitive about his body fat, apparently. Worse than the girl. Well, I, I talked with Jason a lot this morning about how he just needs to start judging himself by how he looks in the mirror. And how you feel. Forget the scale. Forget toys that measure your body fats that are not accurate. I feel great. I don't know how many the more... The accurate is the calipers, right? So I, I'm not qualified to answer that. Here. That, yeah, and I, I think that... It depends on how much, how you pinch it. You can pinch too much, you can pinch too little. You gotta know how to pinch it correctly. Yeah, but that's the old way. Yeah, that's the old way, yeah. Other than, you know, water test. I can't, I can't understand how that that machine can be accurate. No. Well, will you hold it out in yeah, front of you like that? Yeah. I don't know. Like, how does it... I don't know. I have no idea. Apparently, it measures what? Sodium levels? And it changes based on how much food's in your stomach? So, so what if you... Salt water's more conductive. Okay. So what if you do it on... So if you, you're on a full or an empty stomach... It, it affects would make, it, yes. Like, by well, how much? My, my understanding... You or not, too. Let's my ask the expert. Well, my understanding of that device is if you're going to use it, you have to use it consistently, like every day when you wake up, for example. Go, come here, come here. Are you leaving? Yeah. The shit's going away on your face. Yeah, it's good. It's you good. finally stopped shaving with a butter knife? Yeah. In the dark with, actually in the dark with a steak knife, right? <laughs> Jason, when are you coming again? Uh, Friday, 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 most likely. Friday and or Saturday. Uh, I'm off Saturday. Okay. You're off Saturday, you want to come here at eight? Yeah. All right. Whoa. <laughs> they just felt that down in China, big man. <laughs> you know, in my mind, I can get out there and do it, no problem. Reality, different story. You want to start here? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to come here. Make sure this is kind of straight up. All right? And just hold yourself here. Put your arms out. Put your arms forward. Then you can do abs, sides. Yeah. Punch You can throw your punches. Come on. Seems that you got the. Stand straight up now. Good. <laughs> Good job, man. Yeah, thank you. Good job. Hey, if I this, I would like to try to. You want to try this? No, no, no. Oh, do it. You gonna do it? Absolutely, I'm gonna film it. How do you, how do you do This it? must be documented. Oh, how do you start it? I have an huh? insane idea. Four, I guess four, hit, four, five, turn it on first of all. Okay. There's the yes, power so like, set. It was on. It was on. Yeah. You have to program your height, Actually, your weight. Uh, yeah, do it. But well, we don't do it on clients because it takes a lot of time. But I do it myself. Yeah. So whenever you want to do that, you how do you, a calculation we put right in here. Yep. So how do you do this? Hit start. Or set, oh, actually, it's set. There you go. Yeah. Just sit normal. Normal. Your height. Although no one's ever accused Brad of being normal, but that's okay. 
The headset after each thing? Yeah. Is it working over there now? The solar jet? Oh, why well, you got a light like that? Like Oh, I think I now turn, you hit start. I turn the light on because of the juice bar. How do I hit I? start? Start. There you go. <laughs> they're gonna think it's, gonna think hey, it's working. I don't get the 20. Um, I'd like the bed. Yeah. <laughs> she said it's off 5%. If it's, if I'm under 30, I'd be shocked. Really? When are you supposed to do this? Like right. at the first same time every day? That's when you're supposed to do it? First thing in the morning. So you need to be consistent with it, obviously. 20%? 20%. Ouch. You mean ouch. I'll take that. I'll check mine again. What did you oh, think you it was going to be? What's that? Yeah. Yeah, he puts this on YouTube. Oh, for real? These are the uh, Jason Genova Chronicles slash Delray Misfit videos that we Five, do. 10, yeah. Don't ask. You're better off. <laughs> ignorance yeah, you don't even watch. Ignorance is bliss in this case. <laughs> take my word for it. Wait, Jesus, man. You don't want to know. <laughs> but I promise this will not go anywhere you don't want it to go. You have my word on that. She said it was off five. So. Does that mean you're actually 25 or 15? <laughs> you're, you're pulling a Jason, bro. <laughs> you're pulling a Genova. 17.7. All right. Not bad, I guess. You're going to exit the gym on your high note, 17.7. Actually, it's almost a high note. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, off 5%, I'm at uh, 22%. By the way, everybody, this is the sickening, pissening assortment of World Gym shirts that they sell here. It's all mentoning. It, it is also mentoning. These are the white ones that uh, they sell here. These are only $6 each. Then they have some female shirts, a couple tank tops, and a sweatshirt as I hit my elbow. Chuck has left the house. We'll call this a misfit video. Everybody. Have a wonderful week. Peace out, bye.